Oh my goodness, they just wrapped up Judging Day at Miss South Africa 2023 and I have my final top 12 hot picks, okay. There are one or two ladies that are left out, but if they make it, they make it. I'm not the official judge. Anyway, let's get straight to my top 12 Miss South Africa 2023 hot picks. This is how you do it. The wardrobe must be everything. This is hair on the judging day, the interview stage round, and I love everything about it. When you look good, you feel good, and you're confident, I think she will definitely enter the top 12. <laughs> I don't know. Anke impressed me a lot. I feel like she's somebody that is just um, not too much, not too little, just like Ndavi last year. She does lit, need one or two trainings here and there, but I'm pretty sure if they announce top 12, they'll do the right workshops for her. Joe Horden. Jordan has really matured, has really grown. She is. She realized that you need to speak out. You can't just give us face and not, you know, substance. And not, this year, I think she's giving us everything. Laven Donatella, she shocked me today. Her performance was just absolutely amazing. I feel like she's going to shock a lot of people. She, for me, looks like a winner. But anyway, we'll just have to wait and see. Barbara, I already told you guys, if you have the personality, I mean, you can easily win anything because you are already unique. You are bubbly. You are out there. Nothing scares you. And that is Barbara. Natasha, I really did not want Natasha on my top 12 list, but she shamed the devil. She shamed me. Look at her. She is killing the ladies in terms of whole drop. And like I said, if you feel good, you look good, you'll do good. I think Natasha is here to win this competition. If you don't watch out, ladies, I mean, hello. She came prepared. She's not underestimating the process. She might be known for somebody that's resilient because losing at Miss Universe and coming back strong, amazing. Lebura Puze, this HR practitioner is just so sweet, but today she sh she shocked me. Her choice of old drop, her walk, I, I mean, hello, she is in my top 12. She can represent us anyway. I don't even know, Miss Universe, Supra, whatever. Um, Oh my goodness, Naledi Mara, I think I like her community outreach program. I think she's also somebody that will be like Tato Mosekle, that will just shock everyone. Go straight to the top two or win the title. Carmen, I think Carmen should give us personality that she works on camera when she's a model on stage and then she can easily make top five. Look at her confidence when she's working the camera. Exactly. If she, if she can become like this on stage, then everything will make sense. But she's in my top 12. Oh my goodness, Mbumi. She is hard as fuck. I was a bit disappointed in her walk. I mean, Mbali. Where did I get Mbumi from? I was a bit disappointed in, in her walk. She didn't seem confident. But maybe her speaking did the talking and she will enter the top 12. But I like her. Anyway, I like her. She just needs to work on one or two things. Melissa. Who doesn't like Melissa, guys? Show me the person and I'll gladly, like, you know, beat them up. I'm kidding. Melissa's just amazing. I like her old job choices. She's also came prepared. I would have loved to to see more. I would have loved to see like 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 boom on your face. But I don't know. Last but not least, the Rato Maponya. I really liked her. Um, I feel like she's an underdog in this competition. <laughs> I feel like she's the black card. Um, other ladies that I liked that are not sure. Let me think. Oh, yes, there were some ladies who I feel like they really tried in terms of their work, their work and standing out, you know. But I'm not I'm not sure about the others. Maybe they were nervous, but they might enter the top 12. Remember, this is I'm not the official final judge. I don't know when they're going to do the reveal. It might be late this week, meaning Thursday or Friday or next week, Monday. I don't know. Okay, the ladies that I feel like they tried, they might enter the top 12 is Kanya and Nicole, season 8 Survivor winner. I feel like they tried, honestly speaking. I wouldn't be surprised if they enter the top 12, but they're not on my list. But hey, we just have to wait and see. Bye.